Before we start the reaction video, always remember to support the original content creator by using the links in the description below. And let's get it going. And this is still under critiquing, so... This is our first anime session run, and it's going interesting so far. My next life as a villainess. Ooh. This looks interesting. Oh, at a magic academy? Where I, Katarina Clace, meet my doom. I'm gonna go mute for just a moment, guys. Oh, so she was spoiled. Doom Flag Academy. Oh, interesting. That's a really big disconnect from that background art to them. Wow. Adopted? Different mothers? Random genetics? Oh. That other guy is gonna catch her, I'm assuming. Something like that. No! What the f- She fell through reality! Oh man, they're using the trippy mod effects! They put that shit in the new One Piece movie, it broke my brain! Huh. I don't think that's a monkey and I think you know it. Every morning. So she can see her past life? Or this next life? Huh? So is she the... I'm a little lost there. Oh, damn, she fucks herself up. Damn, girl, learn to put your hands up. Really, to put your forearms up. I hit the fast track to becoming an otaku in middle school. In high school, I got hooked on Atome games. And after playing one all night, I was running late for school. So I rushed out in the street and died at the age of 17. That wasn't a dream. They were my pre memories from my previous life. So she went to a different universe. So it's kind of got a similar start to uh, Slime Desu, which is interesting. Her whole personality has changed. Oh, it's just gonna leave a scar. She, she just agreed to marriage without reason at all.
Well, yeah, you shouldn't be romantically... <laughs> oh my god. How could you even be an otaku back there? She's the villain. So she's not in the thing, she's in a video game. She's probably just having a hallucination, right? Who the f knows? So that's gonna be the whole series of her trying to remember the game. I like it. At least it's from the perspective of a of a female, so I get a little bit of perspective. Fostering romantic. Oh no, it's a goddamn dating sim! Ah! She enters the Magic Academy at age 15, and there she meets the four love interests. Jordo Stuart, the third prince of the kingdom. Oh. Alan Stewart. Oh, of course, he's a. Mm. Of course. Keith Clays. 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 Wait, I thought there was only three. The son of the premier. I don't even know what the a premier is. Hey, cool. I lost that guy. Thank God. I hate mm, jerks. Oh. In the batting, they attack the heroine with a knife. She ends up getting attacked. Oh, she didn't have to spend a lot of time. Okay, path that's what she means by the path to doom. Sorry, I gotta my phone is gonna ring as long as I don't grab it. Alright. Oh, it's the intro. She's swinging around snakes. Oh. Interesting. Hey look, colorful burgers. Or no, those would be candies or something, right? Oh, right, that's the other one. What if, if you killed all of the love interests before they grew up? <laughs> okay, maybe not the Russian stealth route. And then she actually likes the premiere. It looks like, God, I'm not supposed to watch these. They ruin stuff. I'm not even supposed to watch these. That's, dude, this one took a minute to get to the intro. But I think it's because of the first episode. Uh, random people. Yeah, I, I, I gotta remember. I, in the future, please remind me, guys, just not to watch intros. They ruin the fucking series, man. Like, I don't know who decided that was a good idea. To be like, hey, let's fucking put all the spoilers for a fucking season at the beginning of the intro. A meeting inside her mouth. Oh, this is funny. So this is comedy slice of life, kind of isekai. It's definitely not shown in isekai. We should just not kick it.
Huh. Black hearted pissed. Not bad. Still feel like you should nip the problems in the bud and get rid of them. Yeah, if you knew you were gonna either die or be exiled, you'd probably fucking train really hard. Converse with the Sorcerer One's magic. Sota. You know, more con. Yeah. 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 Oh shit. Oh right, she looks like a peasant. He's gonna laugh. A little early for that. Oh, right. The actual proposal. Girl, you need to pay attention. Girl, you need to pay attention! Says the guy who doesn't ever pay attention to anything ever. Bro. Bro. Oh, right, her other love interest. Her adopted brother. Oh, right. Secret Katarina. A distant relative who had a very lonely upbringing. At least they're like forming characteristics. Katarina bullied him. So he spent most of his time locked up in his room. As if to bury the loneliness of his childhood, he grew into a frivolous playboy who fooled around with many girls. But after meeting the game's heroine, his loneliness is soothed and he falls in love for real. And when Katarina interferes with that, she's either exiled or killed using magic. True. I'm very confused on some of the shit. I'm a hundred percent serious like that. All oh, right, she's soft-hearted. Right. <clears throat> Not true. I still don't get why her doom or why it would um um too much of the opposite way can also be bad
I think just her being, you know, obviously absolutely different than the f main, you know, villainess originally was. Probably will just change things naturally. But fate will obviously push them back into the correct places. That's what fate does. That bitch. Fate. He's gonna, like, fall down the tree and die or something. Nah, this one's too happy-go-lucky. I mean, listen to the music. See, and that's where the things would get, like, if I make one, like, no one ever does that with, like, the serious ones. So, like, oh, well, I knew she would, like, fall, but she's not gonna hurt herself seriously. Yeah, bump her head. Hit him, maybe. Right, it's all jokey. Uh, interesting. That's really real. Hey, hey, look, you made a little doll. Can you make it move? Oh, you can make it move! <laughs> oh, goodness. How can you say no to those eyes? Son? No, girl! Alright, that's 100% on you. What were you thinking? She already looks different. I feel like something bad's gonna happen to Keith. Uh oh. Yep. Ooh. Yeah, I figured this was coming. Jesus, they really give those action fucking movements a lot of work for these. Like, she jumped down like a fully-fledged ninja, yo. It's showing cast and stuff, so this might be the end. Oh, he took the spare key and locked himself in.
Oh, so that's how he hurt him. Yeah, accidents happen, man. Although that looks pretty bad. You mean a prodigy? Did he crack the floor, or is that just the pattern? Me. Uh oh, she's gonna blow the door open. Oh, Jesus! Holy... All right. She is determined to stay alive. Also, you know how hard it is for a little girl to swing a hatchet? I'm just saying. They can. I've seen it. Also called uh, lots of splinters. Explosion! Real tea! Jesus Christ, just wielding a battle axe. That is bigger than her, by the way. Commune with the earth, motherfucker! Dirt, have you heard of it? Bro. He needs to look out. Hashtag deserved it. <laughs> Alright, well. It's very heartwarming, that's for sure. Um, gonna go ahead and switch over to just the camera real quick. So this should finish off our secondary round of anime recording stuff, kind of. Um, I thought that was interesting. Uh, there was some interesting world building, some unique concepts. You know, uh, it was a little different from what I was hoping to get maybe but that's fine because i kind of also knew like by the feel of the title and the art style a little bit what i was getting uh so it's slice of life it's nice it's relaxed we'll see if we keep going on it depending on if we can even get it up onto youtube a and b if people like the patreon stuff c if you know all that good shit <laughs> sorry language as always i'll try to keep it cleaner for nice series like this um but I liked it, honestly. Um, I'll try to go farther. I've been meaning to go and read some of the manga, but it does look like it has a little bit of touch of Shonen and some of the action and power stuff that'll help bridge the gap for someone like me who sometimes gets bored like with stuff like that. But I gotta go for now, guys. I've been recording for like two hours or so, and I'm tired, so I'll catch you later. Thanks everyone for watching another episode of Reactions with an X, with me, your host Axel Grave. I appreciate every single view and every single comment on these videos. If you enjoyed the video, remember to hit like to show your support, and hit subscribe to see more reaction videos. If you like the other content we do on the channel, remember to hit the little bell and press all to see all of our videos. Finally, if you wanted to leave us a comment or a suggestion on other material we to do, or just to rip us to shreds, Leave a note in the comments and we'll try to get back to you.